hoping to catch sight of uh, a few old British bikes today because today it's the uh, Velocet Owners Club Midlands region, it's their peak run. Usually there's about 50 Velos that uh, come for a trundle in the Peak District. straight on I go down to Athersage but if I go up here it'll take me up to the uh, Derwent Dams, Lady Bower and so forth so this is Lady Bower and it's a uh, nice little run up here reservoirs, you've got this lower one, Lady Bower. Second one is uh, Derwent Reservoir. And the third one is Howden. Because it's right upon the Howden Moors. And the Derwent Reservoir, the middle one, I believe, or oh, no for a fact actually, it was used for practicing for the Dam Busters raid, 617 squadron when they uh, bombed the dams in the Raw Valley. I think they also practiced in the Brecon Beacons on some reservoirs out there, but they, they claimed that the Derwent one was similar to one of one particular dam that they were going to attack because of the approach, the difficulty of the approach to the dam. They had to fly low down the valley and then bank to get around a corner and uh, before they actually got to the dam. Still looking at Lady Bower. Road closed to cars and motorcycles, buses only. to here, it's not far at all, and this is actually Derwent Dam, this is the one where they practice the Dam Busters Ray. very uh, quiet up here today, there are the two towers of the dam, 
beautiful stone structure and in that one there used to be a wonderful museum dedicated to 617 squadron but sadly it's no longer there apparently they've just been looking at the information board it was constructed in 1916 this particular dam This is, uh, this is in the gateway to the tower on the dam and there is actually a memorial stone here to the 617 squadron touching uh, memorial to the men who died Right, I'm just leaving car park at uh, the base of the Derwent Dam and I've just been informed, I've been into the visitor centre and they've just told me that uh, the road is actually open in the week, Monday to Thursday, you can ride up here. It's only at the weekends that they close it. So, here we go. very steady run up towards Howden Dam it's about a four mile trip I believe well here's Derwent Dam, the towers at Derwent about on but it's certainly a pleasant run up here again I think it must be a good uh, 40 years since I last rode up here I think the last time I came up here would be on my old uh, Triumph Bonneville T140 the first one I owned I was uh, when I had a stroll up to the dam, up to the Derwent Dam there, I noticed about half a dozen cars drive by. And I thought it's somewhat odd here because the road says the road is closed, access only for buses. So I just called in the visitors centre on the way back to the bike and inquired and he said, oh no, he says it's misleading. It says the road is open Monday to Thursday. So I didn't need a second invitation. of the uh, the reservoir the water level is quite low in this one actually compared to Lady Bower plenty of potholes to look out for
Right, just when I was giving up all hope, I thought I'd missed them. Here they come. Oh, this must be the bulk of them now. Don't they just sound lovely? I was giving up all hope, I thought I'd missed them. Intervello is a beezer. <laughs> Whether he's part of the group, I don't know. Not all on velos, obviously. Oh, well, we've got an outfit. Well, I think that outfit and last two bikes were the tail end Charlies. I don't think there's any more coming. There was a vehicle following them, a Range Rover, which I think were the backup vehicle. 
uh, he waved to me as they went by so I think that's the uh, the lot of them so I've probably just a little bit late going up here uh, possibly missed some of the uh, front runners but uh, managed to catch one or two and uh, I think I shall now saddle up and scoot off <laughs>